I just can't let you go Lord knows that I've tried to You said I was the only one Hey everyone, this is Kelly from Moon Pie Tarot. Yes, I am back doing your collective love readings. I will be here daily, Monday through Friday, to do these love readings for you. Any and all signs, all of you are welcome. Please do smash the uh, like, subscribe button. If you are a new subscriber, if you are returning, welcome. So happy to see you all back here again. And yeah, I will be uploading between 9 and 9.45 p.m. Eastern Central Time. If you want to get a personal reading, there will be a link in the description box below. Okay, let's get into this. All right, what are the collective messages coming in here for love going forward? Oh, first one out of the gate. I want to kiss you every time I see you. So someone here... Oh, definitely interested in you. <laughs> I don't know if they've been kissing you or if you've had a kiss from someone, but they get super excited every time they see you. They see your face. They see your picture. They just want to place plant kisses all over you. Kiss, 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 kiss. Very nice. They might be sending you kisses or they will be sending you kisses, blowing you kisses, kissy lips, kissy emojis all that kind of stuff very cute very sweet i'm going to make sure that i'm the best you've ever had okay boy somebody here really wants to impress you let's see am i good enough for you wow you really do have someone here who is seriously going to be trying to impress you or wants to they don't feel like they're good enough for you they're going to go uh, like this person is going to be doing cartwheels in front of you flexing um like they want you to notice them this person wants you to notice them they want you to pay attention to them they might be dancing around you you might already be noticing this they might be putting a lot of likes or hearts somewhere on social media if you have social media i, I just feel like they're doing that they're trying to get your attention they've got you on some kind of pedestal totally into you um there i'm also seeing someone who's kind of like maybe hovering around your place of work a little bit you might be bumping into them at odd places like why do you keep seeing that like why do i keep seeing this person everywhere i go if you're out walking your pet um you now all of a sudden see them on the same route that you're walking your pet this person uh, you're going to get your coffee and all of a sudden you see them there you see them there like one day and now they keep showing up um, some of you might even have like some secret messages somewhere on like craigslist or something there there's just my goodness somebody like really really into you oh my goodness okay secret anonymous little messages here let's try something new okay hmm what does that mean uh, let's see. Let's try something new. I'm dying to find out if you are as good in real life as you are in my fantasies. Okay. All right. Well, <laughs> so yeah, this person, I mean, they're like, I, like, I don't even know how many times I can say this. You have somebody here who's they, they want to try something new. I, I kind of get a sense that this person wants to, to go somewhere with you or go be in a place where the, the two of you have never been before or to do something. like So some of you might already be connecting with this person. You might already know this person. And they are... Uh, you might... I, I don't know. Maybe some of you have kind of lost interest in this person. I'm also hearing and they're trying to regain your interest in them there's something so if you have a history with them okay like a past kind of history with this person they're trying to get your attention by doing something different with you to try to kind of um, re-stimulate something in this relationship is what I'm hearing, right? So for those of you who you already know who this is and maybe that like relationship has kind of lost its passion of some sort, I do feel like this person 
is feeling a little like um, losing some self-confidence they're saying or doesn't feel like you're really interested in the, anymore and they're going to start doing some really different things to try to get your attention and these are kind of like off base for them it's yeah that's what they're saying like the things they'll be saying to you or the things that they'll be doing I, I, I kind of hear you saying to yourself what's gotten into them why are they acting like this it's very odd behavior it's it's completely off base for them and you might think that they're going kind of crazy <laughs> or that they're losing their mind or that I don't know are you on drugs like there's something here where you're kind of I see you questioning this person it's just doing like these strange like you know like where you have like um for example like you know how you have the queen sitting on the throne and then the joker comes around doesn't do, does all like these little circus acts and joker tricks and stuff that's the image they're giving me like this animated image uh, like your person's a fool for you <laughs> is acting like a fool for you this person whether it's your someone you're connecting with already or to somebody new coming in as I get a sip of my coffee like this is just crazy so yeah I'm I'm telling you right now pay attention to this odd behavior it might even be like it's completely opposite of how they normally are so for some of you if you were connecting with someone who just wasn't opening up they weren't like talking all of a sudden they're now telling you things that you're like what what why 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 are you telling me this now like what's going on it's because they feel like either they feel like they're losing you or they're refalling in love because there's some kind of <clears throat> they're sensing they're feeling like they're not good enough for you they're sensing like you're either you're pulling away or you're just not feeling it for them anymore something like that so they're gonna come in and it's it's kind of like no holds barred like they got to do something I got to try something new here and, and there's this definite feeling of I'm dying to find out if you are as good in real life as you are in my fantasies for some of you I will get this 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 kind of does gives me the sense for this person like you don't know them <clears throat> for some of you so it's like a 50 50 for some of you you don't know this person and they are fantasizing about or you haven't been with them let me just say that in like a a, a a fantasy type way and for some of you they do have this dress up thing like they want to do this dress up thing speaking of which and i'm just going to segue into this if if you don't know i have started an only fans and i have more explicit tarot readings on the, my only fans channel so if you guys want to subscribe to these types of reading but much more like kind of explicit where I use the cards I used to use years ago but I can't use them here on YouTube anymore because they've gotten very strict with their illustrations and things that we can show you here on YouTube I don't know if you guys remember but years ago I used to be able to use them can't do that anymore so I had to start at OnlyFans where I can use those cards over there and give the readings like how we used to do so go on over there if you want to subscribe go on over there you can it, it, it costs it's like $4.99 I think a month and you don't have like you can cancel at any time but if you want to go on over there and then you get like a double it's a weekly reading so yeah but anyway this person definitely has they're fantasizing I don't know about like dressing up in some kind of costume or uh, maybe some role play kind of thing going on okay just a couple more of that and then we'll get a little bit more into see what the energy damn how did I start liking you so much so I feel like this person they're they're just so crazy into you and I feel like there's a lot to do with you either not being into them as much anymore if you already had a connection with them or that you're just not paying attention or you're just not really noticing or you're just not as into them as as maybe they are into you and so I feel like the sign is for you to just pay attention this person like seriously wants to be with you they want you and they're gonna start doing all this crazy out of the blue abnormal type behavior just it's either abnormal for them or it's goofy <laughs> goofy goober stuff that is just like what are you doing like what are you doing like 
like showing off, flexing, weird kind of, you know, it's just, and even if it's a female, if you're a male watching the female, you're just going to see them just really, you know, like you can tell, like you can tell when someone's kind of showing off, but it's, it's not because they're egotistical or anything. They're just trying to get your attention. So they might be posting like a lot more pictures or putting a lot more likes. They might even be doing the opposite and not, and not posting and not putting likes and starting to ignore you all of a sudden, which like it's anything opposite if you've noticed with what they've done before. Okay, let's try to get a little bit more into this. Okay, nine of wands. Okay, interesting. So that kind of clarifies for me for that some of you, you're going to see if they were, so if they were really like, Okay, that's giving me like flexing vibe. This is giving me the, the vibes of let's try something new. So I always say, and if you've listened to my readings before, this this card always is reminiscent to me of someone who they do this. All right, let me, they were in the middle of a bout. They lost the bout or they, they lost the, they lost the first round. They went back to their corner. They had to re-strategize, okay, how they're going to get back into the next, um, the next round and fight so this is trying something new okay i gotta get back in there i try to try to figure out how i'm going to get the attention of my lover so, so right now um this person and some of you might have already noticed that this person has been trying to get your attention in some way so right now as i'm doing this reading they're they're kind of pulled back a little bit so they're either going to get a new hairdo um they're, they're, you're going to see them show up with either a new hairdo, their body's going to look different, they're going to act a bit differently. I can't say really one or the other, but I will say it's a lot, like a complete opposite of who they were, how they were before, okay? Um, they're going to wear their makeup differently, they're going to change their clothes, um, hair color, dye, a lot of aesthetic changes, um, they're going to speak differently. Um, it's just... Is it fake? I mean, is it putting on a new pair of shoes? <laughs> yes. Uh, and it's all done to try to get you to try to regain your your interest in them or try to gain gauge your interest to see if you will pay attention to them. I don't know exactly why you're not paying attention to this person. We haven't really gotten into that, but I just feel like... Um, yeah, they're they're really checking in to see, going deep within. To they're trying to figure out what you like, what you'd be interested in, what type of people you're interested. Like it's really, they're giving me those like Sandy and Danny vibes. You know how like Sandy was just she had a cute little dress, she had a cute little hair, and Danny was like the tough guy. So Danny went over and then became like um, a jock, and then Sandy went over. They switched roles. <laughs> for each other um because she liked the jocks and and danny liked the the leathers right so so funny this is what's happening <laughs> this is what's happening this person is trying to change their role to fit you they're trying to change their role to fit you and and you're going to pay attention you're going to see and it's not they're just trying to get you to to accept them they don't feel like they're good enough for you. Like you're, are you not paying attention? They're like, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna try to like do what what this person likes, and and so that they will be like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I don't, I have no opinion whether that's the right or wrong thing to do. I don't know. I'm not a psychologist, but I'm just trying to tell you that this is what I see going on. So we have Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy here. Okay, so that could be you. You could be a water sign, or it could be a water sign that is. <laughs> I feel like I'm 13 with this reading. Or it could be a water sign that you're dealing with. So let me see. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. You got the chariot. Okay. So yeah, this person is going to move things forward pretty quick. Absolutely. They know what they, they're going for it. I'm telling you. So if you, let me give you an example. If you're someone that likes to ride dirt bikes, this person's going to show up on a motorcycle. I'm, I'm just telling you right now you're going to see them on a motorcycle if you're like a dirt bike rider and this person has never rode dirt bikes like all they they were just someone that likes to stay home and bake cookies all of a sudden they're going to start riding it's like a complete contrast all of a sudden they're going to start riding dirt bikes 
and it's to just so that you be like, hey, you're riding dirt bikes. Hey, it, you know, if, if you were someone who liked to stay home and bake cookies and they were someone who just wanted to sit in a bar and drink beer all day, all of a sudden they're going to take this, take interest in baking cookies. You're going to find them baking cookies all day. Like they're going to completely, whatever you want, whatever you like. <laughs> And they're going for it. They're just going to do it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. My goodness. My goodness. Okay. Yeah, they're, they're taking the lead on this. So, we've got the Emperor Aries energy here. They're taking the lead on this. They're watching you. They're curious, trying to find out, like, what are you into? What do you like? That kind of thing. And see how you're going to be. They're going to be watching to see. They can be checking your reaction to see if they're very curious learning about you trying to find out what you like what you're interested in how they can impress you how they can bring themselves to where you are kind of like at your level um, because they because why because who does this the people who do this I, I, I can only like i feel like people who do this do it because they're so enamored by the person that they just i don't know if it's like a psychological thing like i, I just don't know i don't have a degree in that i just all I can think is like it's very flattering and it's very complimentary and I just feel like this person is making a huge lifestyle change to accommodate <clears throat> so if this is somebody that you're you're in some kind of relationship with and I'm seeing this person conceding to try to hold on to the relationship or try to keep it um they, they, they just they're so in love with you like whatever whatever it takes i'll do whatever i'll i'll follow along if, you know this this person might have been praying to the devil and you were going to church and now all of a sudden they're going to go to church you know it's that kind of energy like whatever it takes whatever you whatever i need to do okay hey you know what it is what it is um for some of you i i know my voice sound, I sound like a chipmunk i want you to know that i have since since i've been uploading videos i have sped up the video so the processing time is shorter so i it is me i am not a chipmunk my voice does sound like it has sped up a little bit but that is only for the processing time because i'm uploading a lot of videos these days and i found that if i sped it up a little bit i can the processing time takes um uh, a lot less time to upload videos because i have to process them here first and i have to process them on youtube so you guys will get used to it sorry to tell sorry to tell you you'll get used to it so let's see, what else can you tell us for, um, for the collective about these messages here? I mean, you know, I mean, I feel like it's kind of flattering, I guess, in some way, because uh, I feel like the intention is that this person just is crazy about you. That's what I feel like is crazy. And they're, they're hanging around and <clears throat> they're studying you. They're trying to find out about you, what's going to work what you'll accept what you you know what they can do to get into your group your circle <clears throat> excuse me to be around you to be near you to be a part of yeah it's a heavy burden that they're carrying but they're willing to make this change they're willing to like kind of okay could be an aries like i said a leo or a sagittarius or that could be you just kind of whatever it takes like i mean i feel like this person is going against the green honestly they're swimming up uh, swimming up the river here and it's tough work it's like they're laboring for love this is a labor of love for you that's what i feel like is doing they're doing and coming in with that king of wands energy and that emperor energy is a very powerful force i mean this person seems to have a very strong uh will about this to do this here to make this change i am not even kidding i've never seen anything like this i mean this person is going all out to make this change just to be with you just to have your attention um just to you know, I, I know that's not going to be for everybody. I mean, I know that it's not going to be everybody. That's like some people might find that very sweet and very complimentary. And some signs might be like, ew, no. So, I mean, to each its own. It's a collective reading. You know, some of you 
might agree with it. Some of you, not, it's fine. It's not for everybody. But I do feel like this person is going to go out of their way to either save a relationship or just to be near you or just to be good enough for you. That's what I hear. Um, let's see any other signs here. I'm picking up Taurus and Aquarius also. Okay. Any other messages here for the collective? Before we go. Okay. Well, the struggle is over. So this kind of gives me a sense that with this person, okay, um, and with you, if you if you have been in a relationship with this person already, um, and it's been a kind of situation where you just felt like things weren't going to change or it was just like dead in the water and nothing was going to change. Well, I feel like it's, it's, it's going to completely change like this. Uh, some of you might have just been like, you know, I didn't need all this. I just needed the person to just open up a little bit more. I mean, this person is going from like, doing a complete 180. So, I mean, to going from completely not doing anything to completely doing everything. So as far as the struggle being over with this situation, yes, it's definitely, uh, it's definitely not going to be a problem anymore. Now, if you don't know this person and you've been uh, just in that position in your life where you really wanted to meet someone, I can tell you that you've got somebody coming in here who is ready, willing, able, and motivated to have you notice them and uh, they will do everything and anything to impress you just to be near you, just to have your love, okay? So you've got a new love start happening here, um, whether that's with someone you're already connecting with or somebody new. So good luck. Hope you, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Just good luck. All right, you guys, talk to you tomorrow. Okay.